Hi everyone, today I'm going to talk about a little more about styles. Um, just a little quick recap. We started off in our first video, we started off uh, creating a new template, button template, and we applied to our button that we created. So that was good, but it only worked for one button. Next step, we created a style inside our main window and this is even better because now we can use the same style over and over for every button inside our main window but there comes a point where you need to reuse that style for other buttons in the same application but different windows so you have more than one window then you need to reuse that same style then what that's where dictionaries come in resource dictionaries in other words and um, so how do we do that i created a little simple cheat sheet over here to refer to in case uh, we forget something so basically, we're going to create, start with creating a new resource dictionary. And the way we do this, we go to Solution Explorer, we select our project, click Add, and then Add Resource Dictionary WPF. Uh, we give it a name. In this case, it's a default name, Dictionary 1. But I'm going to say my button style dictionary resource dictionary dictionary all right Hit add okay we have a blank new brand new dictionary file now all we need to do as first step, I guess, or second step actually, because the first step was create the dictionary. Um, we could, maybe if you don't have any styles, you can create from scratch. But in our case, we already created the uh, style here. So all we're going to do is cut and paste this into our new file. All right. Let's go in there and paste this. So no changes required. That's all good. Let's remove the um, window resources tags so we don't get that nasty error. Okay, now our buttons are back to square one. We lost the style that we created. Okay, we're not going to change anything yet here. All we're going to do is work on our app XAML file. Uh, it's in the Solution Explorer right here. You can double click this and open it. Okay. By default, it comes with a nice application resources tag. So we need to add our resource dictionary. And uh, let's create a tag for resource dictionary. We need another tag, resource dictionaries, merged resources, merged dictionaries. Okay. And last but not least, we need to add the resource. Resource dictionary, source, I mean, source. And here we're going to write the name of the file, which is my button. styles resources style resources kind of a long name but you could make it simple dictionary dot xaml okay and close the tag And probably probably had a typo. My button styles resource. That's a 
too long. Okay, we didn't need this. New source dictionary. If we save this, I think when we go back to our main window, our styles are back in there and still working. Save, compile, and run. Beautiful. It still works. Now, another huge benefit of this is we can use multiple styles. Let's say we have another style. Let's collapse this and let's add another style. Luckily, I have one somewhere here that I created earlier. I'm going to copy and paste this. And paste over here. So now I got another style that I can use. And let's do another one. I have a couple more here. Let's copy this as well. So I got quite a few styles here. Let's collapse them. Get one, two, three. Four styles. All right, so let's apply to a different button. Let's go back on the main window. Let's change the style to this one to green glass button. Let's totally change the look of the button. Let's run this, take a look. Create a couple more buttons and apply each style to a different button. Drag and drop. Let's move this over a little bit. I'm not sure if we're going to have enough space, but uh, we'll try to fit in. Or we can make it smaller. Alright. Let's keep the height and width the same as the default and let's add the uh, style so dynamic resource and we'll add the blue one to this one and let's add another button Give it a new style. Style dynamic 
resource and let's take this one solid brush of course they're all glass or transparent uh, the background of the form is kind of uh, shows through so build and run so we have multiple buttons with different styles all right hope you enjoyed it please like and subscribe thank you